Welcome to the Infinite Campus Teacher Task Training Series. This video will provide an overview of the system and its navigation. Infinite Campus is completely web-based, so I'll launch a web browser. Google Chrome works well with the system and is the recommended browser. The URL is https colon forward slash forward slash Baltimore dot infinite campus dot org forward slash campus forward slash bcps dot jsp. I recommend favoriting this page, but I would also expect Infinite Campus to be linked on the City Schools homepage and TSS as well. The username and password is the same as my City Schools network username and password. This is the Infinite Campus interface. My default application is Campus Instruction, which includes teacher tools on the left outline. Note that the Message Center is the tool that is currently in view. Most of the pages are made up of a toolbar and a work area. The Hide and Show icon allows me to collapse the outline for more work area space. The green navigation bar is where I'll find the Log Off button. Log Off is set to 60 minutes by default. Help, which provides me with help with the specific page and tool I'm currently viewing. The App Switcher, which allows me to toggle between Campus Instruction where I am now, and where teachers will spend most of their time as this application hosts attendance and gradebook tools, and Campus Tools, which is where I can search for students for more detailed information. Campus Community is an online catalog for help and resources, which includes documents, videos, walkthroughs, and forums for all things Infinite Campus. Notifications will provide me information on recent changes or updates, and Calendar Display which is how I view data from a previous school year or from another school if I work at multiple schools. For this section, I will take the role of an elementary teacher at Love Elementary School.